A bizarre sight awaits those who stroll down Burtmont Avenue in Toronto. Corne Van Hopen reports. Leslieville is a quiet neighborhood. Large trees and well-tended gardens line the streets. However, there is one house that stands out. Instead of flower gardens, hundreds of dolls fill every available space on our house and garden. They are not just any dolls. Superheroes, Hello Kitties, and Troll Dolls plaster every available space. Owner Shirley Sue Miser has been collecting these dolls for the past 20 years. Due to Shirley's failing health, she has declined to be on camera at this time. However, she has agreed to an audio interview. I just wanted to do something that was lonely. My husband died. Try to do this. Garden keeps me happy. I look at my garden, I talk to my flowers and everything. It keeps me happy. And I got something to do. Many residents agree that the dollhouse brings a stronger sense of community to the Leslieville neighborhood. I think it's great. It brings uh, people to the area. I've met people through it. People want their picture taken. It kind of brings a sense of community and uh, people that own the house. Uh, Shirley, I've gotten to know her. She's great. She's friendly and uh, I have no problem with it. I think it's great. It's different. Different's good. But I know some people uh, don't, don't like it. Um, but I don't have to live across the street and look at it every day, so maybe that's a different, but I just live up the street, but uh, as I say, I, I like it. There's always people out front, you know, taking pictures. I've met people. Shirley's son is often spotted switching up the decorations. With Halloween just around the corner, there's a particularly strong horror theme to the gardens this year. If seeing unique sights in Toronto is your thing, come out to 35 Burt Mount Avenue. For Toronto Observer, I'm Corne Van Hopen, Toronto.